Hey, what's up you guys? I hope you had an amazing holiday season and now New Year's Eve is up around the corner. I am beyond excited. I don't know what I'm wearing yet, but I'm just so excited for the new year. Oh my gosh. So I just got my hair done. I don't know if you guys can tell. I got it cut a little shorter and obviously a little blonder. I got my latte here. But yeah, I just felt like standing up. I was just getting really impatient sitting down to be honest. Um, I wanted to do a December favorites for you guys where I show you guys, you know, all of my favorite products of this last month between finals and some things honestly that I got for Christmas, but there are Already, like amazing favorites I wanted to do this video because I'm also going to be doing a 2018 favorites video where I talk to you guys about my favorite products of 2018 but like obviously I don't know these products enough for this month to include it in that video so that's why I wanted to do this video these are like products that I've just like recently found out about that I really really like but then I'm gonna do a video coming next of all my favorite products of 2018 I'm so excited I love videos like this so yeah forgive me I'm a little sick so I sound a little stuffy um but yeah the lighting here is just so bad in my room because I left my ring light at college because I just didn't want to transport it and I'm just really regretting it. I wrote down a list of everything I want to talk to you guys about and let's just get started. And obviously I'll have everything linked down below. You guys know I've gotten really good with the links. So I'll have everything linked down below that I talk about so you guys can easily check it out, use your Christmas gift cards, all that fun stuff. And yeah. I'm excited. My first favorite is something that I actually mentioned in the podcast of this week. So if you guys don't listen to Gals on the Go, who are you? My best friend Brooke and I have a podcast together. And this week I did a solo episode because she obviously lives in New York. We go to school together, but um, we don't always have time to record together. And in each episode, we talk about our current favorite. And my current favorite, guys, is this cropped Sherpa hoodie from Princess Polly. And unfortunately, I can't find the exact one on their website anymore, but I'll have a similar one linked down below. I don't know what it is. It's not even just that it's Sherpa. I just think I really like cropped hoodies right now because having like a bigger bottom, like it's like weird to like wear these long sweatshirts and they like cover your butt, but then it just like looks weird. So like I'm kind of into the whole cropped hoodies with like high-waisted leggings look and like sneakers. Like you feel so cool and like you feel really fit. <laughs> so, um, and I'm working on the whole fitness grind, obviously, aren't we all? Um, but yeah, I'm really into just cropped hoodies in general. So I'll have a feeling down below that I'm obsessed with, but um, yeah, this cropped Sherpa one that I got is seriously amazing. I love putting the hood on. I'm just, it's so cozy. I love it. Next up is actually something I have right here. Um, this is a Hydro Flask and I've had a Hydro Flask before, but this one has a straw and Brooke has been telling me forever and a lot of other bloggers that I watch and podcasts listen to, they talk about how you need the Hydro Flask with a straw. And it makes so much sense. It's so much better because normal hydro flasks, like literally you would take the lid off and you drink like this and I would spill it all over me while I'm driving. It just wasn't ideal. But guys, in the past like four days or four days, Christmas was on the 25th, it's the 27th. Like let's get real Danielle. The last two days, I just keep filling this up and I just can't stop drinking water because it's just right here and it's so convenient and it's really addicting and it's helping me take in my water intake and when I'm home for the holidays or when I'm on vacation, I don't drink as much water. So this is awesome. Like I still love my small water bottles, but this, this is a game changer, except I already dropped it. So there's a little dent, but it's okay. It gives it character. It shows I, it shows I use it, you know? Brooke is just about to get a ton of shout outs in this video. So shout out to Brooke again. She will not stop talking about the Lululemon Align leggings because I always get the Wonder Under leggings. They're my favorite with the Lux Stream. They're perfect for working out and they're still my favorite leggings for working out. However, Obviously, we all wear leggings to just hang out. We don't actually work out in them all the time. So I got a pair of the Align leggings and they're a little bit more of a softer material. Like they definitely collect to like lint more, but I love them. They are so comfortable. They're so flattering. And Brooke was saying when you wear them, you feel like you're wearing nothing. It's true. Like I don't feel them on my legs. Like they're just so comfortable and I cannot stop wearing them. And they're super high-waisted, like, like really high-waisted. I also have a short torso, but so flattering, so comfortable, like I've been living in them. But I'm not gonna work out in them because I can see them getting ruined really easily. Like definitely not for spin because I feel like they'll rub up against the bike. Um, so that's where I go with the Wonder Unders. But Lululemon Align Leggings, ah. My next favorite is actually an artist. Um, I'm obviously a big music gal. I would say I'm really, my favorite type of music to listen to is like rap and R&B, hip hop, that kind of vibe. I like pop, I like country, I like alternative, but my most listened to music is like Drake and Post Malone and um, like J. Cole, Jeremiah, that kind of vibe. I don't know why, I've always, like Bryson Taylor, that's like who I wanna listen to, Skizzy Mars, oh, so good. But I recently came across the artist and I hope I'm not saying the name wrong, Ella May or Ella, Ella, Ella Mai, I'm not exactly sure. She's 
absolutely so talented. A few of her songs have like been on the radio lately. That's how I found out about it. I think her popular songs on like the radio right now are Boot Up and Trip. Like, uh, Boot Up. Uh, boot up. I, I don't know. I just feel like that's what I hear on the radio. I love Spotify and their beautiful features. One of them is when you like like an artist, they have like a this is playlist. So there's the this is LMA playlist and I am obsessed with it. She is so good. All of her music, it's kind of like Kalani vibes mixed with like a little J. Cole. So it's got some soul to it, you know, and uh, her music is so good. My favorite song right, right now, I like She Don't and 24-7. Oh, so good. If you guys kept up with Vlogmas, you could have saw this coming. My next favorite is the Dyson Supersonic Hair Dryer. I love my dry bar blow dryer. <clears throat> it's really happy, it's yellow, it's awesome, but it's big. And there's times when I am traveling and I really need to bring a blow dryer, but I need a smaller one and I wanted it to be super, super powerful. And I've only heard great things about the Dyson blow dryer. And Callie knew I really wanted it and she texted me one day and was like, Danielle, they're 20% off on Ulta today. And I was like, okay, it's a sign. So I got myself the Dyson blow dryer for Christmas. It's amazing. It's like this big. You literally turn it on and like in my vlog, I was like, whoa, it like makes this sound because Dyson, they're known for their vacuum cleaners. And then they just come out with this blow dryer. Like this is insanity. So, um, you know it's gonna be powerful. It's absolutely amazing. It blow dries my hair in literally three minutes and I have very thick hair. Like, I'm not kidding. Like, it's amazing. And they come with two or three different attachable heads. Amazing. We got it for my aunt for Christmas. She loves it and she blow dries her hair every day and like, she's getting rid of her like, tr pride and joy um, blow dryer for the Dyson because she loves it that much. It's amazing. Seriously, I love it. Link down below. Not sponsored. But, it's great and it's changed my life for the better. I'm all about finding products and could just improve my life quality, you know? My next favorite are something I've been wearing like crazy and they're actually on my ears right now. Um, they're these earrings and they're like these gold, hollow, chunky gold, gold, I already said that, earrings. Love them. Um, I have to give all the credit to Maggie McDonald. If you guys don't watch her videos, she's just literally my life inspiration. Like she just works out every day. She's so beautiful, so perfect, so just organized and happy and just has the best simple style. She was wearing these earrings in all of her videos and then she said that they're from Target and they're $6, you guys. So I literally went and bought them. I bought two pairs just in case these get ruined or something. Um, but I've had them for about a month and I just love them because they're since they're hollow, they're very light. So you don't really feel them and they just add this perfect accessory to like any look and like they're $6. I hope they're still online and if I find them online, I will link them down below. If not, one similar because I know my friend has these exact ones from H&M. So like, my next favorite is a dry shampoo and it's not the dry bar. I'm really just cheating on dry bar in this video. Um, <laughs> a lot of my friends were telling me to try the Living Proof dry shampoo and it really is good. I think I've always liked the dry bar dry shampoo because it smells really good and it smells like the dry bar and it works pretty well. But I don't know if like my hair maybe got used to it or whatever, but it just wasn't working the last few times I've tried to use it. So I got the Living Proof one. It's a little bit more expensive, but it smells amazing and it really works like instantly you spray it in your roots and it's just lifted and your everything looks so good and I'm love it. I love it. My next favorite are a pair of shoes that I've been wearing a lot lately and I've been getting a lot of questions. I have to say when I first showed the shoes in my Princess Polly haul, everyone was like, oh girl, I like everything but those shoes. And now I posted a picture on Instagram yesterday and people are like, wait, you changed my mind. I like those shoes. So they are the Windsor Smith sneakers, I think that's it. They're from the brand Windsor Smith. I got them off of princesspolly.com. They're basically an elevated Fila sneaker, like those white chunky Fila sneakers. These are like this much higher. I wore them this morning to get my hair done. Like I personally like them because I'm 5'3", I'm short, and I really like how outfits look when I'm taller, and I just I just like them. And I like chunky sneakers because they like your they make your legs look slimmer. So I'm loving these. They definitely are like they literally give me so much height. I was so much taller than my dad. <laughs> But yeah, they're amazing sneakers and they're definitely an outfit staple and they're way cheaper than the Balenciaga sneakers that I just don't think I'm ever gonna get at this point. My next favorite is this leopard tote. Would it be a Danielle video if there wasn't something leopard in it these days? Um, I also got this tote on Princess Polly. I showed it in my Princess Polly haul like last week or the week before. Um, but I love it because um, while I'm home, I don't really bring my backpack around, but sometimes I wanna go to a coffee shop for just an hour and you know, take out my laptop and just get some work done. Or even I've been like spending the night at my friend's house lately because we're all just being kids and having sleepovers. And this is just the perfect bag. So it's like pretty big. And then it has one little small zipper, which is really convenient for like more things you don't wanna lose. 
Um, I just really, really like it and it's really darn cute. Even if I go to like a workout class and I wanna bring a change of clothes, I'm into the tote, I'm into the tote. I still love the DC backpack. I think there's still a few left. I know a lot of you guys got my backpack for Christmas, which makes me so happy. I love mine, it's right over there. Um, so yeah, I always have a link down below to my backpack if you guys want it. Um, but yeah, oh wow, I'm such in a good mood and I have to go, but I like wanna film three more videos after this. Hmm. My last favorite would have to be my iPad Pro. I didn't know if I was gonna love the iPad life, but I really love the iPad life. I had an iPad when I was like really, really young in like middle school and like my brother and I shared it and we like played games on it or whatever. This, this is just an elevated, this is just elevated, this is awesome. So I got the iPad Pro, I'm very, very thankful for Christmas. It's the 12.9 inch one, look how cute my background is. And I got the Apple Pencil, which magnetizes right here. And I actually got it engraved and it says D. Carolyn, it's really cute. Um, but yeah, I have the iPad Pro. And the main reason I got it is for school because you can use these like note-taking apps and um, you can like make folders. Because I really just want to go paperless and I don't want to be carrying a ton of notebooks around. And it just keeps everything organized. You can upload PDFs to um, your iPad and then you can draw over them, you can highlight them, which is going to be perfect because mm, I'm really lazy and I don't want to print out what my professor sends us. But this way I can just put it on my iPad and I can refer to it like literally in class and be like, oh yeah, I see that here and I can highlight and do my own thing with it. And I don't have to worry about taking busy notes and I can actually pay attention to class rather than like focused on like taking the notes because I'm a note taker like I love to like do all the different colors but sometimes it gets a little too much so this way it'll be perfect um but obviously I'm not back to school yet so I've just been like playing around with it and it's just like I feel like a productive queen you know I'm just like sitting here it's funny because Kenzie got an iPad Pro for Christmas too and she texted me and was like let me know what apps you get because we both got it for the same reason I believe so it's like really exciting and you can I can work on like designs and stuff I've been drawing Drawing on it just for Zen it's fun but please comment down below if you guys have if you have an iPad and you use it for school and what apps you like for or if it's just productivity apps or just anything app related that you love and you have on your iPad let a girl know comment down below let's all help each other out um, I'm really excited I know some of you guys got iPads for Christmas too so I'm pretty hype about the iPad life and yeah I'll keep you guys posted on how it goes we did it! Oh, again I wish I could just sit here and talk forever because I'm in a great mood and I think the coffee's kicking in but I am once again headed to Oxford Exchange <laughs> my like favorite brunch place ever and I'm going with my bestie Caitlin because um, she's not gonna be here much more of winter break so we have to like have our our hangout time before she heads out before New Year's so I'm gonna go do that um, but I love you guys so much thanks so much for watching I have a ton of videos coming up I'm gonna do I, I'll just tell you guys why even keep it a secret I'm doing a 2018 favorites video I'm gonna do a get ready with me on New Year's Eve video I have a video where I'm gonna talk about my goals for 2019 and I also want to do a video where I reflect on 2018 or I'll combine the two I don't really know what to do I don't know if that's like too much 2018 2019 New Year stuff um, but those are the plans that I'm gonna film for the next few days oh so I posted on my Instagram story and I was like hey guys like what content do you guys want to see in 2019 and I literally went through all of the submissions and I wrote down everything and a lot of you guys want more fitness videos a lot of you guys said maybe college days in my life instead of college week in my life I know Brooke's done that I don't know do you guys want me to do like three days and then post it and then three more days I don't I just don't know if I have I, I don't know like a part of me that I want to do college week in my life or just daily vlogs but I just don't think that's gonna happen because I really like doing videos that aren't vlogs too and a lot of you guys wanted more travel videos like pack with me and tips and you guys want it all and I'm here to do it all. I'm ready for the content, content baby content. If you guys listen to Pretty Basic Podcast, I love Remy and Alicia, but yes, I'm gonna go. I'm totally gonna be late. Caitlin, I'm sorry in advance that I'm late. Um, but yeah, I love you guys so much. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you guys soon. Bye.